So a case manager is standing there by the river and a baby in a basket comes floating by and the case manager pulls it out and puts it on the side and saves the baby and feels pretty good. And the next day the case manager goes by the river and there's two babies and pulls one out with each hand. Does a great job. The next day there's three babies. Pulls all three out, writes a report, sends a bill off. Um, you know, feeling pretty good about the sex. Next day there's, there's four babies. Next day five, six, case manager all of a sudden gets another case manager involved. They're both there pulling babies out, writing reports. All of a sudden they need a supervisor to schedule them to pull out the babies at the right time. And they're pulling babies out right and left. And pretty soon there's hundreds of babies coming down the river in baskets. And there's about 100 case managers pulling babies out right and left, you know. And then the advocate comes up, takes a look at the river, looks at the babies, looks at the case managers and says, hey, what's going on here? Hey, we're pulling babies out of here as fast as we can, doing what we can, you know, writing reports, sending them off, getting the bills in. The advocate looks at the babies, looks at the case managers and says, we'll see you later. Case manager says, where are you going? You can pull the babies out. Advocate says, no, I'm going to do some advocacy. Advocate walks up the stream, sees who's putting the babies in the water, stops it right there. That's the difference between advocacy and case management.